forced to do a lot of retrieving already. And, uh, too much there, even for him. Shoulder height there at least, but still able to connect. Another one of those wingspan catching hold, taking brilliant flight up the line. And that really tested the speed of Schwartzman, which is electrifying. Contest remains. Absolutely epic. A marathon exchange between these two. That is a huge hold of surf. It is Schwarzman set by seven games to five. The defending champion seven takes the commanding lead. there and comes back with another gem <laughs> that is immense the way he came back there to slide across that's what he had to do into the shot and he's caught out Schwartzman here Finally, his 10th break point is converted. What a point it was. I mean, Schwartzman did so well to chase back, deal with the lob and extend the play as he did, but...
wonderful again. Such good work from Kasper Ruud, and he has levelled this final. Oh, good. Stunned silence, and yes, again, tapping the legs, not launching as he hoped to there. Oh, it's a stunning shot. Yeah. Plenty of flight on it, and well, Schwartzman <laughs> staring at the mark and really disbelief. It's not going anywhere. Relentless from Root. Casper yeah. Root is champion again in Buenos Aires. His second Argentina Open title. It took a mighty effort to topple the defending champion, Diego Schwarzman, what he has contributed to this week. Absolutely awesome. But ultimately, Rude finds a way again to beat him on clay, to do it for a second time. And now, to claim the seventh title of his career. Some match it was, 5-7, 6-2, 6-3, in two hours and 35 minutes. Café Rude.